I'm about one finger breadth down. And then this is the lateral edge of the patellar tendon. This is the medial edge. You can see he had an old surgery. And then the joint line for the lateral side is right here. And that's my portal there. And the medial joint line, if I run my finger, is right here. And that's my numbing portal right there. And then here's the medial edge of the patellar tendon. So if you look, it's slightly more lateral on the lateral side compared to the tendon relationship compared to the medial side. Really simply, let's say you're going medial, what I do is I create a skin wheel. So then I make a big wheel. So the most important thing is to go in and out. When you're inside the inner articular portion, I don't put any lidocaine in, but I come out back to the capsule. And that big wheel is really important to make the marking. And then lastly, typically what I'll do is I'll put a Band-Aid at this point so the poke hole doesn't have, it doesn't leak. And then what I tell the patient typically is you have like eight to 10 minutes to just kind of relax um, while the numbing medication kicks in. So I prep out this portion here. So there's two markings on the say, needle tip. It's at 30 and 60. The sweet spot to always know you're inside the joint at the medial or lateral compartment is 45, splitting the two. So here's a really good example of getting yourself in trouble. I'm only at 30 in. If I retract my needle sheet, I think I'm in, but I'm not deep enough. You see me push myself in, come in. So there I'm in the joint, right? So there is a compartment. If I drop my hand at this point and try to show them that ACL, I'm gonna get into the ligament of mucosa and I'll be lost. Do not ever do that, right? So what I'll do is I'll take this point of reference. I'll extend the knee. So look at that, I fall right into the compartment. Always do a four by four and paper tape. Do not do a band-aid because sometimes they can see through and then you just tell them they can't go in a swimming pool for a day or two.